This is Anna Hoffman with Traffic Generation Cafe, and this is your Periscope on Android, your A to Z tutorial, part 3. Previously in this Periscope video tutorial, we've learned everything about creating your Periscope account, setting up your Periscope profile, and finding and following interesting Periscope broadcasters. In part 3 of this Periscope on Android video tutorial, you'll find everything you need to know about watching a broadcast on Periscope. There are two types of broadcasts you can watch on Periscope. One broadcast by people you follow, and two broadcasts from around the globe. Tap on TV icon to watch people you follow. Tap on the globe icon to watch random people around the globe. Pretty simple, right? So what can you do when watching a Periscope broadcast? First of all, you can chat. Tap on the chat box to leave a comment. Also, follow what others have to say. You can also see live viewers count. And exit broadcast. You can also share broadcast. To do that, you need to swipe your screen up to see more info and then share broadcast with others. But be careful, not all broadcasts are share worthy. If you keep sharing everything you watch, people will start unfollowing you. Like I unfollowed the marketing dude who kept sharing these kinds of broadcasts. You can also hide chat. Tap on the dots to see the hide chat option and then hide chat. And that way you will not be seeing any comments on your screen, just the broadcast. You can also block users you don't like. To block a user, tap on their comment. Not that I would want to block mom23, okay? but that's just an example. Then you can block them to your heart's content. Here's a quick tip for you. When you block a user on Periscope, that user will not be able to follow you or view any of your broadcasts, chats, or hearts in the app. You will also be unable to follow or see that user's broadcasts, chats, or hearts. This seems like a good time to talk about Periscope hearts, isn't it? The way Periscope measures popularity is by the number of hearts any given Periscope user has. The more hearts you have, the higher up you'll go on Periscope's most loved list. Since you can only earn hearts while broadcasting, we'll talk more about getting hearts in our next video. But for now, here's what you need to know about Periscope hearts as a viewer. Periscope hearts are like and unlike likes in that way. Yes, you give a broadcaster a heart to show them you like what you see, but you don't have to stop at one. Hearts are more similar to applause in that way. So when watching a Periscope broadcast, give the broadcaster hearts to show them you like what you see. Simply tap the screen to see the hearts float up. In part 4 of this Periscope on Android video tutorial, you learn everything there is to know about broadcasting. I also encourage you to read and bookmark my full Periscope tutorial at trafficgenerationcafe.com. It's constantly updated to reflect all the latest Periscope changes. You can find my full Periscope tutorial at the link on your screen or in the video description below.